Make my eyes water, dude. Chris's eyes are watering, just in case anybody wants to know. Uh, hello, everybody. Here we are, 360. Thanks, everybody, for your prayers. Yeah, I was feeling uh, pretty gloomy for a couple of days, but it's gone. I'm 97% uh, back. I don't know where I came up with that number. By the way, I'm going to turn it over to Red so I make sure uh, YouTube is clicking, and I'll be right back. Okay. Hello, hello, hello. How is everyone? Here we are. 360 delayed by one day. Why? Because there is no way that we can do a our passive 360 without the mighty Marty DeGamo. So uh, he rang us this morning, said, hey, guys, how you doing? Uh, should we do it today? And we said, yeah, why not? Let's get it in. Uh, let's do a 360. Uh, get you guys in the mood for tomorrow and what is happening. So uh, here we are. Uh, we've got a couple of updates. Want to talk about obviously what's coming up uh, tomorrow, and just a bit of a general chit chat as well with Chris Johnson and Marty DeGamo. Uh, Chris Johnson, over to you, my friend. Well, hey, hey, you, you guys, you guys understand we're a team. We fly together or we die together. Marty was sick. Uh, he. I listen, first thing this morning, I knew that he was great because he received so many prayers because he said, hey, idiot, what's happening? And I know when he starts calling me the names that that man is 100 percent. So I am blessed to have you two as my brothers. And I'm very thankful. I do. Before we start, want to call a few other people. Uh, I know Bill Muntz is not feeling good. Uh, Deborah Goble, uh, her mom broke her ankle. We're wishing you a speedy recovery. And. Bruce Gerstein, I know you're under the weather. And anyone else I missed, I apologize, but we're always praying for you. See, on Passive 360, on Passive in general, we care about everyone, not just a few. You send me in prayer requests, I'm going to put it out there. That's just what I do. But you are in the most wonderful position and place right now. You're looking at three of the sexiest guys you've ever seen in Passive. You know it. Marty DeGarma leads the pack. Oh, what? Janet Butler's password was Marty so sexy. I think that's what it was. <laughs> That was funny. You know, I had to say it, dude. I couldn't help it. All right. Back to, hi, everyone on my YouTube. Let's let, go back to Marty. Marty, go ahead. <laughs> all righty, all righty, all righty. First thing, I want to give a shout out to uh, Heroes. They were supposed to be on it, too. And we bumped them out. Uh, I totally forgot about it. I was told after we set it up. But they were cool about it. They're going to be on Saturday at 2 o'clock. So uh, they said go there. If anybody's having trouble migrating, they're still showing how to do it. So I would take full advantage of that if I were you. Get over there and see what's going on. You know that there's a corporate meeting tomorrow at 1 o'clock. Look, I dropped something off at the house. I think it's a mailman, but I'm not sure. Because he kind of ran afterwards. Um, yeah, 1 o'clock, so be there. As the post says, you're going to want to be there. We know that things are happening because we know what's been going on. A lot of work behind the scenes. Scenes. I mean, we might think, oh, it's smooth, nothing's happening. Couldn't be further from the truth. They are busy, 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 busy. And uh, once again, thanks, everybody, for your thoughts and prayers. And it was just uh, lasted about 40 hours, 48 hours. Yeah, it knocked me out after my last live. So other than that, everything's good. The family's a little under the weather but they're coming out of it too so uh hey that's what happens especially when you got a petri dish for a home all the kids come in here we, we're gonna get it all right there's no way of getting out of it it's too the house too small and there's too many people but that's part of life no big deal um yeah i've been uh look around the back office and if you've been in the back office you should notice by now it's getting it's sharper, it's quicker, it's fast, it's all the stuff. I mean, like I do, I use their trim every day now, uh, and it's fantastic, absolutely fantastic. The one I did a week ago, I don't, I think it's a handful of countries that somebody didn't click on it. It shows everything. It shows where they've been, what city. I, it's really phenomenal. And all these products that we're going to get, and what really blows me away and everybody here, is they're free. I mean, can you imagine? What are we going to be selling if they're free? I mean, that, that's unbelievable. You know, and I, I know people think, well, we're waiting, we're waiting. You know, if you think about what's been done up to this point, we haven't waited that long. 
I went back and looked at um, Zoom, not like I'm trying to prop them up, but it took them a long time to get going. In fact, they were at 15 people total that could be on a screen. Then they went to 25, and it was months. Look at all we've done in, in a little over two and a half years. I know it's been four and a half since the concept, but remember the first concept we never did. We bypassed it and went right on to this ecosystem that's going to blow you away. All of us here have seen the back office. For you out there that are watching this today, tomorrow, a year from now, whatever, if you haven't seen it, it costs nothing to go look at it. It costs nothing to go look at it. And when you see what's there and what it offers, and one click away from anything that you could possibly want, one click away. And I believe as time goes on, I honestly believe one click of anything that you possibly want, whether it's physical or digital. I really believe that. And what's more valuable than uh, time? Nothing. That's all we have is time. Um, passive is going to save people time, and it's going to change lives, but it's going to change people's time. There'll be, a, you know, there's a lot of wasted time. You, I know when I marked, I had to go from one, one item to the next to an app to something else to bridge them. To get, and by the time you get to the last component, you almost forgot where you started, especially if you're doing any kind of follow-up. So it's a pain. But with this, I don't care what business you are. I don't care what you love. I don't care what your passion is. I don't care if you're a guitar player or you teach French or you're a ship like Red. You can come in down passive and shine, shine, shine. I believe that with all my heart. And if you don't, something's wrong because it's not, it's not on passive. The, the the platform's there for all of us to do whatever we whatever we would want to do. Over to Red. Uh, thanks very much, Marty. Actually, isn't it funny that when we work together, we always uh, prompt each other uh, for something that rattles a little bit in your brain. I think, ah, oh, yeah, let's go with that. And uh, Marty's just uh, given me a very good prompt of something that happened on Christmas Day uh, for myself. Now, uh, I was at my sister's and they had her family there and also a friend there as well. And drinks were flowing, food, all the rest of it. And my brother-in-law and their family have a very, very successful business. And we were in the kitchen and I was talking to the son and his friend. And his friend works for Expedia. Now, we all know Expedia, massive company, uh, digital. And he is the digital controller uh, in the UK of Expedia. Basically, what does that mean? He buys and sells uh, people's data. OK, so it's big, big business. And he, he just uh, written out a check for two million pounds for access to people's data anyway they started asking me red what you're doing these days all the rest of it and i said told them um a little bit about on passive now one's a businessman and one works for a very large company and the businessman said to me what can on passive do for my business so obviously i explained some of the things and all the rest of it now he couldn't get his head around that it was all going to be in one place and he didn't have to go for there. And he said, what happens if I don't want this part? He said, that's not, I said, it's not a problem. You can just have this bit. And they, he really couldn't get his head around that. You can cherry pick or you can bespoke what you want for a business from on passive, just for your own needs. And once he started understanding, he thought, yeah, this is pretty cool. Now let's move on to his friend, the, the guy who does data for uh, Expedia. When I told him how many founders there were, which is 1.4 million founders, and when I told him what we paid for that founder's position, he could not get his head around why our CEO hasn't sold that data to someone. He said he is sitting on a digital data gold mine just with our information that he has there right now. And when I said we, we don't need to sell it because we're going to market our own products and services to our own people. And then with I think and I said, and I think within a year, people will be coming to us to market with us. And he said, well, why isn't he going off selling it? He could make a fortune just by selling it right now. And I said, 
because we don't need to. That's not what on passive is all about. We are not the typical business model. We are completely different. And it showed so much in his face, so much in what he was trying to process that how can he be doing this when there is so much money to be made by selling this data? But that's not what we're about, is it? That's not the ethical thing to do. That is not why we are in on passive. We are not on passive has not been produced to collect people's data so that we can then sell it. On passive is pre being produced so that everybody wins. And how does everyone win in on passive? Simply by joining the ecosystem. Whether it is free or whether it is paid in the future, you will see, succeed with on passive because we have something for everybody. It doesn't matter what you do. Whether you're in business on your own, whether you're an individual, whether you are trying to market or anything else like that, on passive ticks the box that you are looking at. And this is what's going to be the difference. And he said to me, well, why hasn't anybody else done this, what on passive is doing before? And I said, because everything else has been profit led. Everything that you do, you do for profit. My brother-in-law's business, they do it for profit. Expedia, they do it for profit. On passive, do we do it for profit? No, we do it because it's the right thing to do. We do it for the value. We do it for the right reasons. And this in turn will bring profit. Don't get me wrong, guys. All right, there, we there will be and there is profit to be made, whether it's in commissions, whether it is by direct sales, whether it is by the efforts of the company, there is profit to be made. But the first thing, the very first thing that is more important than any of that for the company is the value, the ethics, and above all, what we can give to the consumer. Once these people understand how on passive works, how it is going to be beneficial to them, once that penny drops, the light bulb goes on and go, well, hang on a minute. They've got this right, haven't they? We are going to be teaching these people how to do business in the right ethical way, because it's not just about profit. It's not just about selling it for whatever it is, to make that dime, to make that buck, and then leave the people alone. Once I've got your money, I don't care about you. This is not the on passive way. And in the future, they will be coming to us. We will have courses on Academy teaching people how we have done it. I know I've gone off a little bit because I had nothing. Back to you, Chris Johnson. Some really good nothing there. I think I'm wearing off on you two. Uh, again, I will say, Brother Marty, Brother Red, it's an honor and a pr privilege to always be next to you guys, even though we're far apart. Whoops, hold on. I'm sorry about that. I don't know who that was, but I hung up on him. Uh, <laughs> I do want to do a great show. Red, you, Red and Marty, I, I'm bouncing all over my head crazy, but I do want to say some things. I do have a little today. First of all, I want to wish a very happy birthday to Myra Aquino. She probably thought I forgot about her because I didn't say it at first, but uh, Myra Aquino, I want to thank you for all the help you've given me. Uh, I want to thank you for speaking two languages, helping out with our Spanish friends, and I hope you have a wonderful birthday. Uh, happy birthday. I think she's 21 today. She looks like she's 21. I don't know. Um, I, I'm going to bounce off Fred. He said something. What can a passive do for you? I absolutely love that question, and this is really weird how, where I'm going now. At approximately 10 to 3 in the morning this morning, uh, I get a text message from a beautiful sister. Uh, her name is Johanna Kitika, if I said that right. Papua New Guinean, okay? She sends me this video, most dangerous ways to go to school. All right, now there's a whole bunch of these all over the world, but she showed me Papua New Guinea, and she showed me a journey of an 8-year-old and a boy and a 12-year-old girl to go to school. 
Now, you know our stories, our parents used to say, oh, I'd walk, there goes the dog, I'd walk 10 miles and 100 feet of snow. You know, we all heard it. We told our kids the same thing. Now, this is going to blow you away, and I want you to watch it. I did share it on my Facebook. Just scroll down. You'll see it. Dogs. Uh, it's live. I feel like I'm in the Garmos house right now, but it's okay. Uh, I watched this video from 3 o'clock in the morning till almost 4 o'clock in the morning. I didn't get to finish the whole thing, but I was blown away. Two kids, an 8-year-old and a 12-year-old, a boy and a girl, seven days. Seven days of walking through barefoot now, jungles, snakes, and the thing I learned about Papua New Guinea, there's more animals in Papua New Guinea that have been uh, found that no one knew about. There's more, how do you say it? There's more creatures in Papua New Guinea that no one ever knew about they find each year. New, new, new frogs with fangs. Have you ever seen that one? So these two species. children. The what? species yes thank you red my my species is out of tune today <laughs> so these two kids and it's it's a really good documentary walking through this jungle barefoot the one father went along what i found out is they got across these rivers many rivers they don't know how to swim they're scared to death but but at the very end to get to the school after the seven days they have to cross one of the biggest rivers that separates everything from real people or real, you know, civilization. And these kids are terrified. They got to go in a little canoe. But the first thing I thought when Red says, why unpassive? That's why. When there's kids, David Bacow texts me, this is rural parts of Papua New Guinea where these kids have to travel seven, 10 days more to get to school. Now, when they finally, if they do make it to school, some kids sad to say, get bitten by a very poisonous snake they have there, and they die instantly on their way to better their life. Seven days, folks. I want you to watch the video. When they finally get to this school, they have to pay them about 100 kina. It's about $150 after everything said. Now, they got to carry that money. Now, they got to go through some pretty bad, rough areas. And I'm thinking, first thing I thought is, oh, my God, the bridges we could build just to help these kids' roads. Not even roads. Now, remember, when these kids get there, no, they're 8 and 12 years old. They don't see their parents for a year or their family for a year because that's what the school duration is. One year. All right? And then they got to walk back. There is no buses that pick them up like we had when we were kids to take us to school. All right? There was no uh, cell phones as they were walking through the jungle. <laughs> they had nothing. And it's all videoed. I want you to really check it out. What is my why? That's my why. Because first thing I said is, I never knew this part about Papua New Guinea. Now I understand. I understand what a passive is going to do for them. The eight or 10,000 founders that we have in, in Papua New Guinea uh, need bridges. We need bridges. We also need to educate them how to swim. Because that's one of their biggest fears. But that's the impassive why for Papua New Guinea. Now there's parts all over the world, guys. I'm going to start sharing these series of different parts of uh, most dangerous ways to go to school. Can you imagine you at eight years old? Right now, now they're not walking through snow. No, no, they're walking barefoot, one extra shirt, snakes, frogs with teeth. Imagine that. And then when they get to this river, actually the little boy was so scared that he went back with his father. The little girl pushed down at 12 years old because she wants to be educated. Kids every day in Papua New Guinea and around the world risk their lives to better educate themselves. So when your father or you tell your kids you walked a mile and 10 feet of snow, I want you to think it totally different. All right. Here we have automobiles, buses, whatever. Over there, they don't. Me, I would love to have bridges built, but I'd also love a helicopter service. You know, once a week that fly those kids back home to see their parents. Is this all doable? Absolutely. Oh my gosh, it's doable. This is the why for impassive guys. Papua New Guinea is everyone's right now, it's a big heart, but there's other parts of the world, the same thing. But when someone says why impassive, that's why building bridges for kids, saving lives, roads, getting getting a um a doctor where there should be one. There's 
Many schools in Papua New Guinea that actually closed because the teacher, they had one teacher, they just left. Went, went, went from two days to seven days of walking to get to a school. All right. Why? I'm passive. This is why, guys. This is my why. Building a bridge ain't nothing. All right. Getting materials is nothing. We have now a company called on passive with Opless that is going to make this things, these things happen to better their lives. And we're going to take it throughout the whole world. That's just my spiel today. I just wanted to let you know how lucky you really are, not only for where you live, but the company that you're in now is going to make these changes in life. And I really, really can't wait to see that. Uh, Marty, back to you. My God, Chris, I have nothing. Both of them said they had nothing about 10 minutes ago. Um, no, it was beautiful. You know, I, no matter how bad things you think they are in your life, there's over a billion people that have it worse. Really. I mean, I, I thought about being sick, but imagine being sick and not having a roof over your head or being out in the street. I mean, you know, I can't wait. I mean, I, I'm given when I can give, I give. And I'm gonna. I'm probably going to die a broke man, but with a smile on my face. You know what I mean? Because I, it feels good to give. There's no doubt about it. I think we are meant to give, really. Um, but yeah, needless to say, I'm using some of the stuff in the back office, blown away of what we're seeing. If everybody would take the time to really go look at what everything does, Otrim knocked my socks off because when I went and clicked on the little emblems next to it, I found out, you know, all the different stuff it does. And Otrim by itself, it's free, by the way, which is mind blowing. But it will track everything you do. It's like a mini tracker. So yeah, I, I'm really happy with that. I just feel like we uh, died and went to heaven on earth here. We're very fortunate to have what we have. Very fortunate to be around people we have. And think about this, the worst times of our lives during this pandemic or whatever, at least we got to join each other and I'm passive. I think it made us tighter and stronger than, than you could imagine. And I love it. I love every bit of it. I've got emails and messages from people I did not know. I knew they were on passive, but you know, you don't you don't realize. And I really appreciate it. I'll never forget it. And um, I'm gonna turn it back over to Red, but hey everybody, thank you so much and be ready for tomorrow. Um actually before you turn it back over to me, uh look who's snuck in. Uh, just before I do hand it to uh, Ashmi Farah, by the way. Uh, I don't know uh, if you guys have just seen the news, but uh, very unfortunately, uh, one of the greatest footballers in football in history has just passed away. And the legendary Pele has just died, unfortunately. So uh, as we are, were a massive part of the World Cup, I think it's only fitting and it's only right that we should uh, collectively send our condolences and prayers uh, to his uh, kids and the rest of the family uh, to Pele. What an absolute legend uh, he certainly was. Now, not only one gate crasher have we got, uh, but Dr. Super is here as well, along with uh, our CEO, engineer, Mohamed Kamal. So without further ado, I'm going to hand it over to Ash Mufara. We are just checking if you're doing okay. You're doing fine. That's it. We're bored. We have nothing to do, and we saw that uh, yeah. we can have some fun here. Amazing. I think we're here for a quick uh, uh, update. We saw that you're live while we were in a meeting, and Dr. Soha wanted to come and say a quick uh, update to everybody. Well, thank Guys. you for, for taking us. Thank you very much again. It's good to see you. I'm so excited. I'm shaking, shivering, all the feelings all together. I was like, I need to say that by myself. So Marty, Red, Chris, thank you very much for having us quickly. Tomorrow, everyone needs to attend live because we are going to be using... Oh, connect up to 60,000 capacity. So we're going to host pretty much everyone. Yes. And this is like our grand news for tonight. I'm so glad to see you today. I'm trying to get, you know, acquainted with some of the features so that tomorrow I can present. It's brilliant. 
I love it. And please do not miss it. We really want to see you all. That's it. So we were just having fun. And we said, let's let's just uh, drop the news live to everyone. Yes, I'm so excited. <laughs> so, so Thank glad, guys. Thank you so much. Absolutely. So uh, tomorrow, 1 p.m. Eastern time, please uh, translate the time in your time zone. And it will be the very first time that we go live to the public or to a larger crowd. We've been doing that, in fact, uh, multiple times today, this very day and everything is uh, good. Every time we go live, we discover some fine tuning or enable this, add that. I said enable more. So they are created, but more features. So it's gonna be overwhelming rather for the first time. So we wanted to open up to 60,000. If you're familiar with similar platforms or outdated platforms, it takes them ages, decades to get to a 60,000 uh, 60, threshold. We are hitting that on the very first session. As a very bold uh, uh, ambition, we're taking. Uh, if all goes well, the next time is going to be 100,000. And then catch us if you can. So within about a week after the new year, uh, we will go another one. And as, remember, we have multiple phases and multiple editions. Tomorrow is the basic and the first one, and we're gonna test some of the features. Ultimately, when you see us next time, it might sound different, okay? It, it, it will look different. In fact, I thought before, I thought it will be almost identical, but it will be actually visibly different than what you will see tomorrow. And we want to test that live. We will not charge you. We will not let you have the account, you nor the public, until we give it the go. So tomorrow is rather a very strong exercise. We're going to rehearse, all right? And that is history. You're gonna be on the very first O-Connect session ever created. Hope you can That's make true. it. We can only yeah. take 60,000. We could open it on, uh, Facebook and uh, and YouTube, but uh, our uh, executives chose not to the first time, again, for testing and examination reasons. If all goes well, we do 100,000. If all goes well, then we can connect it to those different uh, external platforms and we have no limit after that. But the least to say, as of now, we outdid everything available in the market as of now. Before we even go, you will see features that you've no, not seen. I mean, yeah, they all do the video, the audio thing, but that's it. Black, plain, boring, all right, expensive, difficult. So uh, we are looking for Susie McRae, Gina Leva, yes. <laughs> and of course, Julie Wen. And whoever is going to be available from the ladies and hosts, we can have, we want to have just a dozen or so from us to be live. Of course, our managers in the background as well, because we're doing a lot of watching in the beginning. Uh, we're going to give you a separate link as an admin for or the, uh, the panelists. What's good about that? Uh, Engineer Mohammed Kamal is going to tell you one of his favorite because he's been doing webinars on different platforms <laughs> for ages is one control panel, one screen. You don't go back and forth, nothing hidden, nothing invisible so at, at your fingertips. So smooth, you will find everything and more control, more features that you've done with any other platform. Uh, the problem is we were holding ourselves until tomorrow to share some of the excitement. Now give us a solution. How can we do that now? We have about 20 hours or so, 20 plus. How could we do it? What should we do? I don't know, I'm just struggling now. I, I don't know how to sleep. I'm so excited, I can't sleep. We're nervous too. <laughs> yeah, we're so nervous as well. <laughs> Come on, Dr. So Sahar, you, you got to admit, you're probably more excited about your first appearance on the On Passive 360 with us lot than you are about oh, it. Yes, yes. I, true, come on, know? come on. <laughs> you have a point. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> of course I am. And by the way, Marty, how are you feeling? 
Uh, after hearing that news, I am absolutely <laughs> fine. He's flying. <laughs> Very yeah. good. I'm a 400-pound bird. I'm flying. <laughs> I was really so worried, but good to see you. You're always sexy. So I'm, I'm sure you, you're just claiming that you're sick. You're not. <laughs> so here's the deal. Uh, Red Rep, I, I, I'm sorry, but I have to tell you the truth. Okay. So I, I said, can we go announce it now when we come back to our meeting? They said, who's there? I said, Red, Redfern, okay. Chris Johnson, okay. Do we have to go? Do we, are we going to have to stop our meeting and go? I said, and Marty DeGama was there. Oh, let's go. That <laughs> yeah, the deal. Yeah, yeah. That um, yeah. the deal. I'm yes. sure that's it. Uh, yes. oh, yeah. <laughs> We're biased about our love. No problem. All right, guys. So there you have it. Your first O-Connect is live in... 2022, yep. and we're going 60,000 the very first time. All right. Hey, I want to thank all. I want to thank you three for coming at the end of 360 because I'm speechless now. So that's perfect <laughs> timing. Perfect timing. Thank you very much. That blows me away. So, Red, I think you're going to have a series of updates or recaps Saturday, Monday, you name it. All right. <laughs> so it's going to take a while to catch up. There are more stuff coming up. And the okay, next guys. time, the next time, bomb. All right? Because next time is going to be so live excited. from another place. All right. It's getting crazy. So excited. I got, See you. Ca how, how can anybody sleep from now? 20 hours. We're all going to get going forward. I think we should just, like, do something. I have no idea what we're going to do. But you can't sleep after this. Join, <laughs> join Mr. Kamaz Club. All right? <laughs> no sleep club. The no sleep it's just, club. Yeah, the miracles of the festive seasons, guys. Merry Christmas, everyone, and Happy New Year. And that's the least that we can provide. And thank you very much. Wow. We're so appreciative thank for you, everything brothers. you're doing. We appreciate you. We, you. we love you, and we appreciate what you do. And uh, we thought that uh, through your platform, we can invite the rest of the founders. That's why we did not put the link in the back office, because uh, it's going to be uh, connect. Yeah. See? Sneaky, put it sneaky, together, guys. Sneakies. <laughs> so you're gonna see the Okanak link in there. You're gonna have to put your oh, just 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 spoiler alert. Okay, the first time you will put your name and email so it can be unique. This is not integrated with the ecosystem. If you have the link, you'll be able to join. All right. Now, after we test this test and the second time, the 100k, we then we no longer have to have a link. It will be integrated with just a click of a button inside your ecosystem when you go to O-Connect. So for those haters who are <laughs> waiting for the evil action for O-Connect <laughs> not to see, you see it tomorrow, you see it the next time, and you're going to be blown away. So you better, yep. you better be kind. All right, see you. Cheers, guys. Thanks very much, guys. Thank, oh, thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, you for you coming on. Day. Yes. Thank you. Bye. Thank you, guys. Thank Bye. you. Cheers. Thanks, thanks Mohammed. Mohammed. And we had nothing. Thanks, Mohammed. Oh, wow. Wow. I'm blown away. I, listen, I owe Julie one apology. She's probably listening. She said, no, Chris, I'm telling you. I said, no, 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 no. But holy shiitake mushrooms, guys. What? Listen, sleep, and I just threw my bed on the front lawn. I don't even need it anymore right now. It's done. <laughs> 60,000, 60,000. 60, 60, oh, 60, I mean, come on. And That's as I way. Said, that's way above you. There's no way Zoom could go above 20. They die now. I know. Oh, now, now I'm shaking. I'm literally shaking. I know, right? I know. Man, I've been waiting for this for a long time. I saw him flat. I saw him flash yeah. up, and I went, uh oh. <laughs> uh. Well, yeah, but then I see Muhammad, and then Doctor Super. I'm like, uh oh, there's something going on. Here it comes smack. I told you, I'm passing. Guys, that is that is so cool that they came on, isn't yeah. it? I really, I really am speechless. By the and way, and we did not know. That's the honest truth. Everyone say, why didn't you say something? I go, we didn't know. I swear no, to God, I, we didn't know. We didn't know. Very cool. Uh, nope. uh, that is, uh, talk talk about dropping a bomb. 
I mean, he's <laughs> dropped he's dropped some bombs in the past, hasn't he? Nothing but like that. that. That That's is the, the that is that is that is Hiroshima standards as far as dropping oh, the bomb is that, that's, that's the mother of all. <laughs> Isn't mother it? Of all oh bomb. my word! Yeah, I, and and as he said, for the haters out there, soz guys, that you were wrong. You were wrong, and all I got to say that's is, it. bite me. Yeah, you were wrong. You know what, uh, guys? I'm not kidding you, Red. This Pedro, like, thanks for your super sticker, dude. <laughs> this is like, to me, that I'm going to wake up tomorrow. And there's this big, big arse present under my Christmas tree, even though I don't have a Christmas tree. This is what it feels like, all right? Christmas is just over, but when in passive, it never ends. Guys, how, what better way to end the year with no. Ohio Connect? I mean, look at my dog. He's barking at the grocery lady, but she's excited too. <laughs> Your dog's excited hey, or the grocery lady? Guinea. Papa New Guinea. <laughs> this is what it's all about. We're coming. Don't you forget that. We are coming. So, oh, oh, connect. Oh, connect. It's, it's one of the biggest things that they're going to do to bring people yes. because it's connected to so many things. So many things, like, yeah. <clears throat> wow. wow. I, I, am, I am just... I know we're just sitting here like three freaking stooges. I, I know, know just going, uh, what what can we say? What can you say after that? I mean, what can you say after that? You know, it I, I did not know that pro, was coming. To pro, I know to process that that not only are we going to see O Connect, which is we were ho- let's get let's get it out there. Let's be honest. We were all hoping that we would see O Connect by the end of the year, weren't we? Honestly. I certainly was, and I know that lots of other founders were secretly oh, no hoping doubt, we would see. No doubt, no doubt. So yeah. not only have we got the news that we are going to be seeing O-Connect, not only is it going to be live, but also with a capacity of 60,000. 60, and as Marty was saying earlier on in 360, he was saying that when Zoom first started, tell him again, Marty, how many did they start with? They, I think they could have 15 people on a screen and it took a month. They went to 25. No. And we're starting with 60,000. 60, Come on. That alone, without the features, without the um, dashboard being all on one place. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Just, Sorry. My mic's yeah. on. <laughs> it's, just, it's just going to... What a it, game changer! Game, 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 game changer! You know, I, I if I if I sound excited, if I'm sounding completely incoherent and crazy, it's because I am so excited about this. I, I really am. Chris Johnson, help me out, man. I, I listen. Here, I want a quick message to all you people that didn't believe us. To all you people that listened to us for four and a half years, Red and Marty few years for me, the rest of us. Put that in your pipe and smoke it, baby. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. I told you on Passive is coming. It's here, and we are now going to bring on the heat. All right? Be ready, guys. I've been telling you, my all of us have been telling you, prepare for your future. Prepare what on Passive has to offer you. All right? Remember I said about packing those suitcases, getting everything in order? Do you know how many little steps it took to get to this real big step we're about to take tomorrow? All the work that went into it. And what did we do? We got on webinars and we talked about it. That's what I'm talking about. To all you people that are going to be customers and resellers in the future, come on. We welcome you. We welcome all of you. On Passive is truly going to change the world. I can guarantee it. Marty! Now, before you go there, Chris, I reckon my bumper stickers told you so. Right, OP are going to be flying. <laughs> Marty. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was he a forgot all about that today. flu, didn't he, Red? Marty forgot yeah. all about the flu, didn't he? <laughs> yeah, it was it was a it was a it was good medicine, that's for sure. Wow. That's for sure. Wow. Yeah, wow. Yeah, everyone's saying thank you, Texan Ash. Appreciate you. Thank you, Dr. Super, Dr. Muhammad, or Dr. Muhammad. He's going to Yeah, right, them. really. Thanks, Ash. <laughs> uh, Dr. Super and uh, 
uh, Muhammad. It was, I'm really yeah, glad they yeah. came we on. Appreciate you. They, they appreciate didn't have to say that. They didn't have to come on here and do that. So no, I was, not I at all. It. But <laughs> as I, we always, but as we always say, Marty, we all three of us say it. If you want the most up to date news of what is happening in on passive, there is only one place to come, and that is right here on on passive. 360. Shut up. All right, Keep, baby. <laughs> we're gonna go on that note because we can't <laughs> make it go. better than that. I oh. gotta go too. All right, bye.